World Health Organization and related organizations. Okay, 395 grants totaling 3.6 billion to the WHO. He pledged up to 100 million for the global response to COVID-19. He pledged 279 million to the Institute for Health Metrics and the evaluation at the University of Washington. That's that IHME uh, model that, of course, initially uh, you know, wasn't all that accurate in predicting what was going on with this virus. And he gave 13.5 million in grants to the CDC Foundation. People think the CDC is just a, uh, an, you know, an, kind of an independent government agency, but they get money from the Gates Foundation. So it seems like Gates has his hand in pretty much everything pandemic-related, Cheryl? Well, here's an interesting tie. So Bill Gates, for the longest of times, wanted to have the World Health Organization declare coronavirus a pandemic. And the World Health Organization did not want to do that. So a day after Bill Gates, through his foundation, announced an infusion of $50 million into something called the Therapeutic Accelerator to help fight coronavirus and find a vaccine. Much of that money to go toward the World Health Organization. One day after the, that announcement, the World Health Organization Secretary General came out and declared mm -hmm. coronavirus a pandemic.